Hello, and welcome back to the Reiki Gem Wellness Channel. Today, we are going to be doing a guided meditation with Sodalite, the stone of true voice. For those who've joined me for guided meditations before, welcome back. And I hope you find this one particularly useful as well. And for those who are new to the channel, my name is Shannon. And I'm a certified Reiki master and teacher and a certified gemologist. And I combine those skills and passions to provide you with the knowledge, tools, and opportunities to practice crystal healing in your everyday life. And these guided meditations are an opportunity for you to practice working with particular gemstones. And today will be satellite. Today I have this piece of satellite and I'm wearing satellite. And I have pendants and bracelets available in my Etsy store below. If after this meditation you feel like satellite is a stone that you'd like to work with more. You don't need a piece of satellite to benefit from this guided meditation today. Um, but if anything in the meditation calls to you or sends up a red flag, it's an indication that maybe you should work with satellite some more. If you do have a piece of satellite, then feel free to go get that and place it near you you won't be holding it right away. But also, if you haven't yet watched the video Improving Your Life with Satellite, then I invite you to pause this video and go watch that one. It's not long, it's only like eight to 10 minutes, and I'll put a link to that above. And that'll give you a really good feeling for the benefits and the energies of satellite before we start in on that meditation. But let's begin with satellite today. Satellite is the stone of true voice. And today we're going to be working with that voice. And our first step is to find a comfortable seat. It could be on a cushion, on the floor, it could be in a chair, it could be directly on the ground outside, anywhere where you can sit up and you'll feel comfortable sitting for about 10 to 15 minutes. So once you've found your comfortable seat, then close your eyes and take a couple of deep breaths. And as you breathe, bring your awareness into your body and see how it's feeling right now. Notice if there's any tension or holding. What's going on with your body right now? How does it feel to breathe? And bring your attention to those parts of your body that are in contact with your seat and the ground beneath you. Feel the strength of that connection to the earth below you. And just know that you have the entire mass and all of the energy of the earth supporting you right now. It's right below you. And then pick 
up the piece of satellite if you have it and place it in your non-dominant hand. This is your receiving hand and will receive the supportive benefits of the satellite. And take several breaths to just feel the satellite in your hand. How much does it weigh? Is it rough, smooth? Does it have any crevices? Just take some moments to get to know this particular piece of satellite. And then bring your awareness back to your body and see if anything has changed as you hold the satellite. How's the quality of your mind, your emotions, your energy? Check in with all of those aspects. Don't try to change anything or fix anything. Just notice what's going on. Notice if anything changes, but don't force any change to happen. And then imagine a blue light that's emanating out from your throat and then surrounding your head and your shoulders. Supporting your access to wisdom and your voice. And sit with this energy of satellite for a moment for several deep breaths. Satellite is the stone of true voice. And as you sit with satellite, consider the following questions and see if any of these stand out to you more than others. Is there anything about yourself that you've been hesitant to share with others? Do you find it difficult to be yourself around others? Do you work in a profession in which you need to communicate with others to facilitate communication or to share your vision with others? You know, is there a situation that's causing you to be maybe a little too emotional to discuss something right now? Are 
Are you in a position or a field in which you share your wisdom with others? Or where you're learning wisdom from others? If one of these scenarios stood out to you more than others, then let's sit with it for another couple of minutes and see if anything changes about how you feel about it as you hold the satellite. Take a look at the state of your mind and your emotions and your body. And has anything changed from when we started? It might not today. It might take longer sitting with satellite, but just note if anything changes. And now release that scenario and release the image of the satellite energy and just bring your awareness back to your body and your breath and take a couple more slow breaths. feel ready, open your eyes. Mm. Thank you so much for sitting in meditation with me today. And I hope that you found this exploration of satellite useful. And these meditations are meant to be repeated if you find a gemstone that you'd really like to work with some more. So if any of these scenarios really called to you or made you anxious, then that's a sign that satellite is one that you should work with more. You should find a piece of satellite and then try to sit in this meditation two to three times a week for a couple of weeks until you can really call up that energy of satellite and what you need from satellite as soon as you pick it up. We want to make these our, like our guardian stones that will help us quickly when we're in need. And if you're new to the channel, I review a new stone every single week. On Thursdays, I post a video about the healing and supportive uh, benefits of a particular stone. And on Saturdays, I post a guided meditation with that stone. 
So if you're interested in exploring a lot of different gemstones and finding the most supportive ones for you, then make sure to subscribe to this channel and you'll know whenever I post a new video. Thank you very much and I hope to see you again next week.